Congratulations. You just had a brand new baby. Your baby is out. So, what is making your tummy still bulge? Is it the belly fat? Is it loose skin? Is it your hormones? Or uh, what? My name is Ngo and I am committed to helping you look your best, no matter your age. And if you find this video useful and of value, don't forget to subscribe and share with people, women like you that just had new babies or people that cannot get this belly fat to go away. This video is all about pregnancy power, <laughs> why it is there and what you can do about it. How do you get rid of it? We'll get into that shortly. Pregnancy pouch is a combination of all of these things that I've mentioned. The belly fat, the loose skin, the hormones, ETC. It's a little of everything. The baby's weight. Come to think of it, how many kilos did your baby weigh? The baby took up some space. Your Remember when your baby was growing, your intestines had to give way. Your stomach politely left room for your baby to grow. Why is it there? Your abdomen stretched to accommodate the growth of your bouncing baby, your bundle of joy. Your hormones that were produced during that time made you put on some weight. And now that you know how it came about, what do you do? It is not as difficult as people think. But doctors recommend six to eight weeks, depending on whether you had a vaginal delivery or a C-section. But meanwhile, as you wait for the green light, there are things you can do to help you immediately. The first thing is breastfeeding. Yes, breastfeeding is essential if you want your stomach, your womb, to contract and go back the way it used to be. The baby not only derives benefits from breastfeeding, you as the mom also does. It helps you regain your pre-pregnancy body weight. It helps contract your womb back so that this pregnancy pouch disappears. Two, breathing exercises. You can breathe in, hold it and tuck in your abs. By the time you keep doing this, before long, you can stay long, and this contracts your womb back to the pre-pregnancy state. Three, walking. A simple walk in the park, around your building, around your block. You can walk your dog. You can take baby steps initially to make sure that your body gets stronger and can accommodate more. And an added advantage is by carrying your baby in a pouch, the weight of the baby helps you lose more belly fat. When the signal finally comes, hooray, now you can exercise. But what to bear in mind is, you start off keeping it simple. You can just start with tummy exercises. By lying on your back, tucking in your abs, and putting your feet flat on the ground. As you keep doing this, your tummy contracts and goes back in the way it used to be. Two, exercises like plank, scissors kick, whatever it is you can do. What exercises do you know about? There are lots of them. You can share some that worked for you or a friend in the comment section below. I would like to hear about those exercises. Exercises can help you by building those muscles around your tummy once more and helping it contract, sending the stomach and the womb back where they belong and where they came from in the first place. The third one and the most important for me is your nutrition. Good nutrition cannot be overemphasized. If you must lose that belly pouch, if you must regain your pre-pregnancy, body weight, your figure, if you must fit into those skinny jeans once more, then good nutrition must be a part of your lifestyle. So, 
I have a meal plan that contains superfoods that will help you achieve that fast. It will be in the description below this video. So why not grab a copy to help you lose that pregnancy pouch? But meanwhile, how many times do you expect yourself to exercise? Listen to your body. Two to three times a week is fine. But when you are stronger and can take up more, and your big body can take up more stress, more strain, then go for it. Overall, your body needs to go back naturally. If you strain your body, you lose that natural elasticity. And with time, you may come back and grow up. So do it gradually. Listen to your body. Sleep well. Eat well. And your body will go back naturally to how it was, or even better than it were when you had that pregnancy. So don't forget to share this video with all other mom friends of yours. Don't forget to subscribe. See you in the next video.